Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. It is uh, October 13th of 2022. And I think it's in five minutes. Uh, they're going to announce here in the United States, the COLA, cost of living increase, C-O-L-A. Of course, it affects people on Social Security, on a whole bunch of, uh, tons of things. Uh, a lot of uh, businesses use that information. Uh, a lot of union contracts. I used to be a member of, well, I was a member of the Boilermakers Union and uh, United Auto Workers. And our United Auto Workers, that's when I worked for our truck company, building gigantic trucks, and our contract, uni contract in there, it was, you know, so much money on such and such a year, whatever. And then I don't know exactly how they worked the COLA, but you got, uh, you got, that was figured in there. So a lot of things uh, are, uh, Important with that. I'm on Social Security, so I'll be getting, you know, I get Social Security every month. And uh, I don't know who all, I'm not sure, I think food stamp people, they don't call it food stamp, they, they haven't called it food stamps in a long time. They call it something else. But there's a lot of things that, uh, Are important you know for this uh, so I think that this is supposed to start in uh, four minutes COLA 2023 headline Thursday 13th of October of 2022 Social Security Administration will announce the 2023 uh, COLA around, oh, okay, I just saw that now, 8.30 a.m. Eastern Time, which would be 7.30 Central Time. How high could the uh, 2023 COLA for Social Security benefits be? Uh, the uh, COLA 2023 will be applied next year, early next year, January, I think. Um, economists voice an unpopular belief that a large COLA increase could have negative consequences. Social Security benefits, work requirements and eligibility, whole bunch of things like like that what medical conditions qualify for social security checks my father and mother you know they worked all their life never missed the days they never missed a day's work and since they were both alcoholics, that's saying something. <laughs> Never missed a day's work. My father was a boiler maker and my mother was a uh, licensed practical nurse. Um, my father eventually from the drinking um, got where he and, he, and he stopped eating. I mean, he just drank alcohol, you know. He didn't eat, a, he stopped eating. He couldn't even stand up then, you know. And he applied for uh, Social Security Disability. And uh, they turned him down. And he actually went to court, federal court. And they, the judge turned him down, said that uh, by that time, my father had been for a few years a uh, business representative, you know, the union. One of the representatives for the union, there was uh, 
had one, and then there was two assistant uh, business agents. Local 83 of the Boilermakers, Kansas City, Missouri. Uh, got where he couldn't even stand up. And uh, uh, so he went to federal court, and the judge ruled, well, you can... Uh, you can uh, work sitting down. Then my father went to Stuart Symington, the, one of the two senators from the state of Missouri, and Senator Symington put in a call, and my father got on to you know, the uh, Social Security Disability. I don't see, of course, they said, let's sit down here. Social Security will make the announcement at about around 8.30 a.m. So, let me just move over here. The... Uh, Scrolling thing up there, please use that, that link. It takes you to um, Amazon. It doesn't cost you anything. But when you use that link and you go to Amazon, if you purchase something, I get a small commission. It does not cost you anything at all. Very few people do it. I, I'm, uh, there was a couple months, a, a year or two ago or whatever, where I couple of months where I got, I think it was like $70 from uh, Amazon <clears throat> because people had used the link. And uh, I, right now, I think I'm getting $2 a month or $20 a month or something from Amazon. And <clears throat> all you would uh, have to do is use that link. It doesn't cost you anything and it would help me out. Because I'm on Social Security, not disability, but Social Security after, you know, I'm working all my life and usually two jobs, a full-time job and a part-time job. Um, and then and my wife and I, we had a uh, tropical fish shop for four years. Uh, we had a uh, security patrol service for about a year. And I've worked a whole bunch of different, you know, different jobs. Um, And so then I got on, you know, when I reached retirement age, I got on Social Security. So I'm going to uh, find out how much extra is going to go on to my monthly Social Security uh, check because of COLA. And uh, it's probably going to be what is a, a large it's going to be, I think, about $175 extra. Uh, we'll find out how much exactly when, uh, when the Social Security Administration. By the way, the I haven't had much dealings with the Social Security Administration, but uh, the dealings I've had with them, you know, they're a large organization, and you know, a business, I mean, a uh, you know, government agency. Not, people make fun of, of course, uh, when you go to try to get a driver's license or something like that, with, uh, which would be a state, you know, agency. Uh, how terrible it is. Uh, but the dealings I've had, which have been purely with, you know, over the phone, uh, Social Security Administration has and great. I mean, you know, everything they do everything correctly and everything just works. And, uh, just wish we had, you know, uh, health care that way. So please use that link above. Please bookmark it or please make a uh, Something on your desktop so you can just click on it. Uh, 
I hooked up my second camera. So the camera up here, which you can see, that's the uh, Avery Media USB. It's a very nice. And two, in a a few videos back, uh, I noticed it also right away, uh, and uh, several people mentioned that it wasn't as sharp. That's this camera, by the way. That it wasn't as sharp, and I agreed. And I, I might have even said it was. I was. I wondered what happened. And anyway, now it is back to its uh, sharpness. Um, okay, I'm not going to kill time here too much. Uh, I will, though, let me go to... Uh, to YouTube and go here. I made a video, I don't know, a week ago or something about cola. And uh, yeah, here it is. Let's see, like a little test of Movidia Video Suite. Windows Insider new build. Uh, I think a new thing coming. Uh, YouTube handles. Uh, about the Amazon link. Uh, about my Sound Blaster card. About the audio problems, I think. Here it is. Okay, this is a video six days ago and. Uh, 65 views. So what I'll do is, you know, I'll link this below the video that I'm going to release this video here. And I will also, of course, uh, which I don't think a lot of you understand, is, you know, I'll also go and then update this uh, one about coal that I made uh, six days ago. Now, I'm not going to go in and edit the, the video that you see, but underneath I'll put in, you know, what the coal amount is. And what I'll do here also is put a link here to, you know, this video. So, so let's go back to... Go there. <clears throat> oh, you can't see that. Okay. Okay, let's not go back here. I'm not a drinker at all because both my parents were alcoholics. Yeah, not a smoker. Also, by the way, never have been. Uh, Coca-Cola is putting Jack and Coke in a can. Drinking a Jack and Coke is about to become somewhat easier. Coca-Cola is partnering with Brown Foreman to make a new canned cocktail combining Coke and Jack Daniels, Tennessee whiskey. Okay. Okay, well, here's a uh, thing from July 14th. I'm going to run this for a second. It says Social Security checks could grow by about 175 a month for an average, you know, person. What do you think Jay Powell and the Fed are thinking, you know, when they see this number? 
They're thinking that we should move forward with the aggressive Fed hikes that we were planning uh, for this month. It's important to get inflation down. They know that that has become the central target for the economy and that a 75 basis points is going to be assumed by the market. Okay. We didn't need to see that. Okay. It's uh, 7.39 a.m. And they said that this might start at uh, 7.30. Uh, Central Standard Time. So I'm going to give them till at 7.39. I'm going to give them till uh, 7. 45, five minutes, and then I'm going to end this video. Then I'll come back, you know, as soon as they announce, and I'll put in underneath it here uh, what the amount, you know, what the percentage is and stuff. I wonder if anybody else, uh, if someplace else may, let me do that. Let's see, when will the Social Security COLA increase for 20 be announced? I, I don't want to know. Here's when the Social Security increase will be announced. Social Security 2023 live. Okay, four hours ago, so I, I'm sure it's not live. I mean, you know. Okay, it's the same spot. But, uh, oh, okay, here we go. It's 8.7%. You see this here? I guess they just put that in there. Maybe they can't afford to... Uh, live streaming of it increase of 8.7 percent so guess how to go to CNN guess how to go to business maybe Let's see, uh, NASA astronauts set to return from space station on SpaceX capsule. Dow Jones, let's see, Dow Jones rises above, uh, rises ahead of the uh, inflation report. Looks like it's going to be eight point. What they say, eight point seven. These power packs are not just specific one, but you know that they're pretty, pretty good. I have a number of these power packs. You know, here I try to keep them charged up. Uh, okay, let's close this. Let me try refreshing this, see if that does anything. How? Well, I guess this is, you know, this is it. Anyway, I will update. When we know, if, you know, this says it's 8.7%. Uh, so. Hey, 
Thank you very much for, um, for watching.